Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. As with any appliance repair, you should unplug the power cord before beginning and shut off the gas supply. To replace the spark igniters in your range, first remove all of the burner grates, the burner caps, and bases. Now remove all of the screws securing the orifice holders to the main top. Insert a putty knife under the main top to release the two spring clips. Lift up the main top and pull the left mounting pin out of the slot first to remove the top. Note the orientation of the spark igniter wires connected to the spark module, then disconnect them. Now detach the old spark igniters from their respective spring clips and pull the wires free. You're now ready to install the new spark igniters. Noting the length and color code of each igniter wire, insert each wire through the appropriate spring clip and orifice holder and push each igniter into place. Connect the wires to the appropriate terminals on the spark module. Replace the main top by inserting the right mounting pin into the hole in the bracket. Then position the left mounting pin into the slot. Make sure the support rods are inserted into the side panel bushings. Then snap the main top into place. Make sure the igniters protrude through the appropriate holes in the main top. Align the screw holes. Then replace all of the screws to secure the holders. Replace the burner basis by aligning the tab in the base with the notch in the main top. Replace the burner caps and grates. Make sure the bend in the grate frame faces the companion grate. You're now ready to turn the gas supply back on. Plug the power cord back in and confirm that the range is working properly.